Samsung Air and Vice Chairman Lee Jong-yong was given a presidential pardon, paving the way for him to rejoin the South Korean conglomerate after being convicted of bribing the nation's president six years ago. One of South Korea's most powerful white-collar criminals, Lee was convicted of bribing the then-President Park and a close confidant to win government support for a 2015 merger, which increased his control over the corporate empire. Lee spent the last 18 months in prison before his release on parole a year ago. So how was the pardon justified? 54-year-old Lee has been granted a special pardon which is effective August 15th, which is also the country's independence anniversary. South Korea's Justice Ministry said the business leader was needed to help overcome a national economic crisis. So what is next for the Crown Prince of Samsung? Well, he's free to join back the board. He still faces a separate trial on charges of stock price manipulation and auditing violations related to the 2015 merger.